Hey there you guys, in this video I'm gonna walk you through how to play Uncharted games on PC. This guy contains the whole setup process and the best settings to optimize your game. So let's get started. First thing you wanna do is to download RPCS3, open your browser, search for RPCS3, click the first link which is the official emulator's website, jump into the download page and click download for x64. Wait for the download to finish. When you are done, go to the file you just downloaded, extract it. You're gonna be needing WinRAR or 7-zip. In my case, I'm using WinRAR. Let's wait for a couple of seconds and delete this. You don't need it anymore. Run RPCS3. If you get this pop-up, just click more info, run anyway. If you like dark mode, keep that checked. Uh, check this and check I've read uh, the quick start guide. Now back to your web browser, type in RPCS3 firmware, scroll down till you see how to update PS3 system software, open that. Scroll down till you see how to reinstall PS3, oh wait, what happened? There you go, till you see how to reinstall system software, click on reinstall using computer, download the update file in case that button didn't work for you just right click and uh, choose open a new tab back to rpcl3 folder create a new folder name it firmware copy the file that we just downloaded inside so you can locate it easily open back the emulator click on file top left corner install firmware open firmware folder and select the file that we just downloaded click open wait for it to finish installing now how to add your games back to the emulator folder you will find the folder named games here where you're gonna be copying your games the emulator will detect them unfortunately i cannot tell you how or where to get games from you guys drop comments help each other out in case your games didn't show up on the emulator Click File, Add Games, and select your games folder. If your games are outdated, here's a simple trick to update them. Navigate to the official website, click on this card, join, wait some seconds. And uh, here we go. Go back to your emulator, right click, go to Copy Info, Copy Serial, and Bot Spam. You find some people actually trying to get updates. Copy this part, paste it right here, and one sec, your game's serial number. Here we go. This is the last update of Uncharted 1. Click download, continue downloading, save, no, not that one. Open and back to the emulator and drag this here. Do you want to install this package? Yes. If you didn't set up your controller yet, click on pads, then go to handlers and it will list some controllers. In my case, I'm using PS5 controller. I'll go, so I'll go with DualSense. If you are using an Xbox controller, uh, 360 or an Xbox One controller, go with the next input. Make sure like it works fine, then click save. And now the final step to run the game. Right click on Uncharted, go to Manage Game and Patches. Make sure you're having the latest patch version by clicking on download latest patches. As you can see, my game is, my, ver my version is up to date, I mean. Check only sh show owned games and 
check all these boxes same as me hit apply and save when you're done right click one more time on the game change custom settings and do same as my settings right here these settings are the best at the moment you can play the game from the beginning to finish without worrying about crashing or anything and yeah there is something you can change it's the resolution scale it's you find it 720p on default you can boost that to 1080p i like my game at 1080p so uh keeping that on 720p will boost your performance a bit but i prefer it on 1080p so you can press apply and save when you are done now we are done with the configuration boot up the game press left stick and start button to open the dev menu on the first option rendering press x if you are on a ps controller press a if you are on an xbox controller we won't turn off all the locks we are having on the screen go down to disable debug rendering disable msg con and keep fps on we need that After navigate to mesh options, disable surface reflections and cell light shadow buffer for better performance. Press start to close the debug menu and there you go. That's it. With these settings, you'll be able to play Uncharted 1 on PC. Make sure you keep watching the video for Uncharted 2 and 3. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Came all the way up here, huh? We're an awful long way from England. Thank you.
It's like the good old days, isn't it? Yeah. When were those again? Oh, wait. This can't be right. You must have made a wrong turn somewhere. <laughs> hey. Now what do you bet that will take us right into the boiler room? And from there, we're in. Yeah, in like Flynn, right? What? In like Flynn. I don't get it. Just give me a boost. Here it comes. Thanks. Almost there. You ready? No guts, no glory. Here we go. Oh. We're good. Reach up there and grab the ladder. Okay, yeah, all right. Yeah. Yeah, I dropped it down for you. All right. This is the way to the courtyard. Well, we're not going this way. Not if you want to keep your skin. All right. There's got to be a shutoff valve around here somewhere. See if you can find it then. You got it. Come on, through here. There it is, just like in Lawrence's notes. Gotta have more faith in me, Sully. Of course, I don't remember this ravine being on the map. Ah, oh, they must have just put that in. All right. Come on, we'll find another way around. Is that a pan flute? This way. Watch your step. Whew. I don't know, kid. You sure we're in the right place? This doesn't seem old enough to be a crusader castle. It's more like renaissance to me. You haven't been reading my books again, have you, Sully? <laughs> now, Lawrence says the original castle was built in the 11th century. The rest was added on later. Ah! 